referee. Bring you the referee. I mean, here we go. More action here on UWC Online. Jimmy Carrot is in the ring. Remember this, Sean? Referee. See, it's actually kind of funny because things have a way of bring themselves back full circle, we might say. See, at this time last year, as a matter of fact, I was in an I Quit match with Jason V. This is true, yes he was. And I don't know if anybody remembers specifically because nobody pays attention to referees around here, but Sean, if I'm not mistaken, All right, I get it from the kids, but you're supposed to be an adult. Right here in the battle zone, Cat Colin Carrot. I guess uh, Carrot's just done talking. I mean, I don't get it. I I can sit here all day until you guys figure out who's actually running this show. Sean, last year around this time, I took that very kendo stick right here, this one right here, and this bend that's in it isn't supposed to be there now, is it? If you don't, in case you don't remember, I mean, it was blood trauma to the head. I dropped you with this and took you out of action, if you can call it action, for over a month. Yes, he did. That's the very thing. So, this whole issue out. going on with Tornado Jones, that can wait. I'm going to talk with him next week. But as of right now, there's a man that's been causing me a lot more grief. There's someone who has been causing me so much problems recently that I just, I honestly just want to take him by the head and I don't want to stop punching him until his face is nothing more than a red smear and a memory. And that man is you, Sean. What? Yeah, you're just an official, and yet, during the Lethal Lottery, if I remember correctly, you got in the ring! And he was chosen as his partner, I mean... Well, your name has been drawn yet again tonight. You can answer the call like a man, or you can lay down, roll out of the ring, and walk to the back where you belong. That's gonna happen, yeah, you're just a referee. You're not even a man, Sean. Stand here and tell me. Look me in the eye and tell me that you have something to offer me. I'm begging you. Keep your cool, Sean. Keep your cool. You're not an active competitor? I'm signing this match whether you guys back want me to or not. This match is happening, Sean. Can do that? And if it's not a match, it will be a slaughter. Now, you can stand here and try to defend yourself. Or I can rip your head off and leave it laying and rolling around here in the ring. Try to die with dignity. Nobody's ever accused Carrot of being classy. Oh. Sean, you might want to watch I out. I... You're not even a man, Sean. Oh. Sean, I'd be careful. I'm serious. I... You want me to stop insulting your manhood, Sean? Do something about it, please! I think he just might do something and he's your head! You wanna fight, Karen? You wanna fight? Give me a referee out here! This is happening now! Did I just hear a referee scream for a referee to get out here? Okay, so this is legitimately happening. This is... This is actually going to happen right now. Jimmy Carrot is going to wrestle against Sean Reif. These two are tag team partners. Just a few weeks ago in the Lethal Lottery, of course, that was a random draw. It was a complete random draw from everybody at UWC Online. Fireman's Carry Takeover. <laughs> Rather impressive with Sean Reif. It was not Sean Reif who voluntarily chose to be Jimmy Carrot's partner. It was not Sean Reif who wanted to be competing in the Lethal Lottery matchup, but fate decided exactly what was gonna happen on that night. Fate is the one who decided 
that Sean Reif was going to be Jimmy Carrot's tag team partner, and Carrot's trying to find somebody to take it out on. But you got to think, all this time around professional wrestling and all these matches, Sean Reif had to have picked up something. This is just so surreal. Reverses the Irish whip. Gets out of the way, gonna roll him up into a pin. Could have it here. Oh! 540 kick to the side of the face. A move that'll put even a regular man down. Even one of the best superstars here in this business have taken that kick and been put down. Come on, this is ridiculous now. Jimmy Carrot pushes Sean Rife into this situation. Oh! Sean Rife might not be a wrestler, but he's a man and he'll fight you with the best of them. Front face lock, this is just so surreal to see Sean Rife competing in a match. And Mike Underwood calling it vertical suplex. All right, end this now. Just end it and let the man go peacefully. Sean getting his shoulder up at two. He did it again. Oh no. He... You know, I always wondered if a referee competes in a match, can he count his own pinfall? And I guess we got the answer. The clutch locked in. Mike Underwood trying to check on his fellow referee cohort, Sean Rife, and making sure he's still okay to go in this match. Jimmy Carrot, not one to mess with or play around with here at UWC. One of the best champions this company has seen. He had a seven month reign years ago as UWC champion before all the troubles in his career started, but now he's finally getting back on track. And every time we think maybe Jimmy Carrot is gonna do something good, maybe he's gonna do something right, things like this happen. Sean Rive hitting the top rope, crotching Jimmy Carrot. Oh no. Sean Rife, you are not Tornado Jumpers. Oh my! Arm drag from the second rope to the ground. Could have it here. I say, Sean Rife, you're not Tornado Jones, the man that Jimmy Carrot is going to face at the heat is on. Oh my God! Sean Rife with a German suplex. Too, but that was impressive. Stomping away now, Jimmy Carrot getting more of a fight than he expected here. Don't forget, it was just a few weeks ago that Sean Rife. Wait a minute, Gold Digger! Gold Digger! Oh, it was academic there. I started to say several weeks ago, Sean Wright was put out with a straight shot to the face by Bo Sawyer in the tag match, but we're going to have to get some help out here. That was an impressive outing for Sean Wright, but I think we're going to need to find this man some help. Oh my gosh, he's back up to his feet. I can't believe it, folks. I just cannot believe it. Online is taking over the world of social media. Connect with all of our fans through the official Facebook page, facebook.com slash UWC Georgetown. 
Watch all the past and current episodes of UWC Online on our official YouTube page. Get late-breaking news and notes when you follow at UWC Georgetown on Twitter. And check out the photographs and still shots from our world-class photographer on our official Instagram page. UWC Online, a truly interactive experience. I know you're down here working out, so you probably didn't see, but when you get a chance to watch coaches. <laughs> oh, and it's sorry, I had to beat the hell out of somebody. When you, uh, when you get a chance, I did, alright? Pay attention. When you watch, when you get a chance to watch what just happened, take notes. Because that, that is how you get things like that done. That's what I want to see out there, okay? You know, you can hear me just think about it, okay? okay. So coming up at The Heat Is On, I'm involved in what's definitely the biggest match in Joey O'Reilly's career. See, not only does he get a chance to wrestle me, but he's in there with a shot at the UWC Heavyweight Championship and Blake Reed. Now a lot of people might be nervous going into this match. I mean, it's a three-way dance, right? I don't even have to get pinned to lose this match. I mean, it's for the title. Blake Reed's a monster, right? But I'm the only one going into this match with nothing to prove. Let me recap a few things for you. Look at my win-loss record. Look at the people that I've laid down in that ring. Frank Wyatt, B-Boy, Norman. I mean, it's really a who's who in UWC. And over the past couple months, not only have I beaten the tag team champions, I've beaten the heavyweight champion. So as far as I'm concerned, I should already have all this gold. But if the heat is on, I'm no longer just champion up here. I'm going to be your new UWC heavyweight champion. You like cheese. You like being a man. That's why you like machismo. Real cheese for real men. Now in a handy aluminum dismantler. talk about an explosion that's ready to go off at any moment then you are talking about this match up here tonight all six individuals will factor into the heat is on in a major way both the champions are being surrounded in the ring right now by the men who will be competing against both of them at the heat is on in the respective triple threat matches and here we go bell hasn't even rang yet Look at this, Joey O'Reilly and Alex Castle working over the Warden in the corner while Bo Sawyer and Sam Knight working over Blake Reed. They're realizing that they're running into the corner. The champions are getting worked over big time here tonight. Both champions sent flying into each other and now down to the floor. The four men currently standing in the ring right now, of course, Bo Sawyer and Sam Knight will be challenging the Warden at the Heat Is On to become the online champion, while Alex Castle and Joey O'Reilly will go up against Blake Reed for the right to be named United Wrestling Coalition champion. Bell has officially been rung. This match has now started. Bo Sawyer in the ring with Joey O'Reilly. Two men who know each other very well. in this match right now 
you take a look at somebody, look at this on the outside, the Warden and Blake Reed working over Sam Knight. But if you look in this match right now, you take a look at somebody, the power of Bo Sawyer. Look at somebody like a Joey O'Reilly, Bo Sawyer, Alex Castle, Blake Reed. Each one of those individuals has held a tag team championship here in the United Wrestling Coalition at least once in their careers in the UWC. And this is a tag team match. The Warden now just working over Joey O'Reilly's shoulder. Some cohesive tag team moves there by the Warden and Blake Reed now. Just think of this, after the heat is on, Blake Reed and the Warden could very well keep their titles, their respective titles, or we could be looking at one of the other four individuals becoming the new champion at some point by the end of the heat is on shoulder breaker. They're going for a pin attempt here. Wait a minute, two. Two count, almost lost Joey O'Reilly there. Blake Reed, the big boy that he is, pushing 300 plus pounds. And Joey O'Reilly, he's only in about the one, 160 or 170 pound range. Shot to the kidney almost. Into the corner, he doesn't want to, doesn't want to be in. Quick tag now to Bo Sawyer. Sam Knight, Joey's tag team partner in this matchup, just watching on. European uppercut. Nonchalant tag there to Alex Castle. Joey O'Reilly trying to fight back now. Shots to the midsection. Castle tosses him into the corner. Clubbing blow to the stomach area. Boot. Joey fighting back one more time. Out of the corner, diving for a tag, but Castle catches him and takes him right back. Blind tag now by Bo Sawyer. Overhead shot. Boom, shot to the side of the face. Went for that spinning back kick. Up on the shoulder, fireman's carry. Joey gets out of it, ducks underneath the lariat, bounces off the ropes. Huge boot to the face. I believe he calls that the dragon dagger back kick. Joey O'Reilly trying to fight to get the blood flowing through his body once again to get the opportunity to reach over and tag his partner Sam Knight who's itching to get in on the action. He could easily reach over and tag Blake Reed or the Warden but he's going for Sam. Tag out Alex Castle and here comes the right hand of God himself. Both men ducking under respective lariats, catches the boot, knocks away the punch on oh, the stare down. Uh-oh. Oh, both men going after the respective champions. You gotta think of the disadvantage. Now wait a second. Shoulder blocks. Springboard DDT. Sam Knight sent to the outside by Bo Sawyer, Joey O'Reilly in the ring. And Bo doesn't even know it. Spinning kick. That kick looked like a dragon's tail spinning around. Uh oh. Fans of the battle zone trying to watch out. Joey is, he's fired up. He's gonna dive. Oh! Joey dives on him. The champions are down. Bo Sawyer is down. Sam Knight catching his breath. Joey in the ring with Castle. Sends him down. Could be it here. Castle barely keeps out of two. Bo is back in the ring. Look at the power. Full Nelson slam. 
Online champion, the Warden, now side headlock. Bulldog. Wait a minute, Sam's in the ring. Ducks under the back elbow attempt. Pulls him in. Huge sit down spine buster. Wait a minute, here comes the champion, the UWC champion, Blake Reed. Into the corner. Oh, 300 plus pounds colliding on him. Boot to the face. Alex Castle's got the champ out in the corner. Could have it here. Warden breaks up the pin attempt. This match is just chaos personified. Warden now with shots to the face on Alex Castle. A little bit of Law and Order might be back into this matchup. Sam Knight just wandering around the ringside area. Joey O'Reilly climbing back up to his respective corner. I think Blake Reed is still down on the outside. No, I see some movement now. Goes the tag, Bo. Bo just ducks out of the way. But what happens if that happens? I mean, Castle is Bo's partner. If Bo gets tagged in while Castle's a legal man, I mean... Quick tag now to Blake Reed. The United Wrestling Coalition champion has been that for several months, a dominant champion, turning back all challengers that come his way. Blake Reed getting a little bit cocky here, jaw jacking with the fans. Front face lock applied. Could be looking to cut the brain, cut the blood flow to the brain, cut the oxygen flow. Castle with those forearm shots to the side of the head, fighting back on the champion. Man, what would a night be at the heat is on if Alex Castle were to walk away as the new United Wrestling Coalition champion? It could very well happen. All those shots to the face, and Blake Reed is still standing, even though he's being supported by the corner right now. Wait a second, over a tag on Bo, but the Warden cuts him off. Alex Castle still the legal man in the match. Blake comes out of the corner, rolls through, tag to Joey O'Reilly. Joey's in the match, takes the buckle to the chest. Joey now. He's going to have the disadvantage of being the smallest guy in that triple threat match, but he too could walk away with adding more gold into his repertoire and becoming United Wrestling Coalition Champion. Boot to the face, kick to the femur, double stomp to the back of the head. Oh! Went to the well once too often, Blake Reed cuts him off. Looking to do the deal. And there it is, the deal is done. Let's see if he kicks out. Sam Knight cuts it. Ducks underneath the Larry attempt, hits the rope. Spear! But watch out, the warden slinking in from the back like the snake that he is. He's got him locked in something. Knee to the face. Sam Knight doing the smart thing, trying to roll out, but he goes with a pin and Bo Sawyer breaks it up. If you think of the type of year Bo Sawyer has had, what would it be if he could name himself online champion at the heat is on? The history between these men. Spine buster. Kick out at two. Joey O'Reilly is up in the corner and he doesn't even know it. Bo doesn't know it. Here he goes. Superman punch. Warden screen to the outside. Alex Castle back to his feet on the outside. I think Alex Castle is the only man that's on his feet right now. The Warden back up. Bo Sawyer is up. Oh! -ho! Spear on the outside. Wait a minute.
minute. Bo and Castle are starting to bo They're starting to draw Jack with each other. He just speared his own partner. Alex Castle just speared his own partner in this match. Oh! Castle tossing Sam into... Or excuse me, this whole thing is getting out of control. Back on the inside, Joey going up top. Ball is down. 450 splash, could have it. He got it, he got it. victory for his team here tonight. If he does that at the heat is on, then he will be the new United Wrestling Coalition champion. Same can be said for his partner, Sam Knight. We could be looking at two new champions here in the UWC. I can't wait for the heat is on. What an event that's gonna be. UWC Online, new episodes every Monday, youtube.com slash UWC Georgetown.